Welcome to the Geospatial Intelligence Podcast. My name is Aybar Sostuna and I'm the founder and CEO of Geospatial Intelligence Institute and Master of Science in Geospatial Intelligence candidate at Johns Hopkins University. Geospatial Intelligence an Emerging Field We'll be talking everything about it. Let's begin. GIS in Earth Science and Geology Field courses are essential for subjects like Earth Sciences, Geography and Ecology. GIS is used in Earth Science related subjects for managing and analyzing special data. Consequently, it provides qualitative methods that are useful for the work done in the field. Geologists investigate the planet's structure, composition and changes that it undergoes with time. The remote sensing application in geology translates into scientists' ability to utilize electromagnetic radiation to collect in-depth information throughout the globe. Interpreting and visualizing the data are two basic essences at, extracted from remote sensors, also considered GIS applications, primarily used by geologists. Individuals with expertise in GIS map out the Earth's surface features, offering guidance for the national resource management. Open data portals are also available, which translates into the provision of extensive data based on valuable information. This data is considered to be very useful for geologists. Special reasoning is specifically valuable in the mining industry, where mineral exploration is done through the utilization of remote sensing and GIS, which results in effective pro prospecting. Utilizing these technologies, the organizations identify probable locations of deposits by mapping surface features and performing spectral analysis in search of telltale chemical interactions. Extensive data, combined with an abundance of leveraged special thinking skills, makes it easier for individuals to carry out effective operations and make sound drilling decisions. GIS in Education GIS offers a powerful decision-making toolkit in education that can be utilized in administration, policy, and instruction. GIS provides administrators with an ability or source for visualizing and managing every operation conducted, such as monitoring the campus security, mapping campus buildings, and managing several infrastructures. GIS also helps academic policymakers see the patterns involved in academic achievement and target new programs. Additionally, GIS also assists students in understanding a variety of content based on disciplines in history, language, art, mathematics, environmental sciences, geology, meteorology, and other important scientific fields. GIS in Ecology GIS has strengthened itself through numerous advancements that is now applicable to most of the fields throughout the globe. One such field is ecology, where GIS has become a significant tool for conducting numerous ecological research projects. However, the utilization of GIS in ecology is less direct than in other fields due to the ever-evolving ecology and still advancing GIS technologies. When using GIS applications, a user might face numerous difficulties in understanding the available data. The data available in front of the user can be very complex, which may cause difficulties in identifying where to be begin their work. However, with adequate training, an ecologist would find it easy to integrate basic GIS applications 
into ecological research and analysis. To summarize, GIS is considered an effective tool for an ecologist and can produce amazing results if used correctly. If you would like to have a variety of sources, feel free to follow geospecialintelligenceinstitute.org that is geospecialintelligenceinstitute.org My name is Aybars Öztunar and this is the Geospecial Intelligence Podcast.